Here, the question is: If you are flying with an economy ticket, there is a possibility that you may get upgraded to business class, especially if you hold a gold card in the airline's frequent flyer program. If you don't hold a gold card, there is a possibility that you will get bumped off the flight if it is full and you check in late. This is shown in following figure. Note that each box or statement has been numbered. Three tests have been run. Test one: Gold card holder gets upgraded to business class. Test two: Non-gold card holder who stays in economy. Test three: A person who is bumped from the flight. What is the statement coverage of these three tests? And then these options are provided. Now let's analyze the flowchart based on the statements to get the correct answer. First point is: note that each box or statement has been numbered. This point is very important, since this is a requirement. We have to consider all the numbered box as statement. For example, in flowchart number one. Two, four, and five boxes are statement as per the requirement. Now let's analyze the first test case. Test one: Gold card holder who gets upgraded to business class. This part of the flowchart will be covered. Here, first check is for gold card holder. As per test one, we are gold card holder. So yes, parts of the code will be executed. Then next condition: Are the business class full? As per the test case, we get updated to business class. That means business class is not full, and this part of the code will be executed. That means with first test case, statement one, two. Four and five will be executed. Now let's analyze the second test case. Test two: non-gold card holder who stays in economy. Here, the first condition of the flowchart will fail, so no part of the it will execute. Second condition is economy full. But as per the test case two, we stay in economy. That means no part of the code will be executed. That means with second test cases, statement one, six, seven, and five will be covered. Now let's analyze the last test case. Test three: a person who is bumped from the flight. Bump of flight is here. That means this part of the flowchart will be executed. It covers statement one, six, eight, and ten. Now, if we'll see the flowchart, only two statements are not covered: statement three and statement nine. As per the question, we have to find the percentage. A statement coverage, and the formula for that is number of statements covered divided by total number of statements multiplied by one hundred. That means eight divided by ten multiplied by one hundred, which gives eighty percent. So, option C is the answer.